10 Best Picks Presents the Top 10 Best Binoculars Starting at number 10. Lupal BX1. The McKenzie line has entry level and low price tags at its core, but it may prove to be exactly what you want. Better yet, Lupal's the name behind this unit. The eye relief on these hunting binoculars may test you with its short 13. 7 mm, not exactly friendly for those who wear shades or specs. But, the optical quality should be better than most since it not only has FMC coatings, it also boasts phase-coated prisms which helps to correct for roof prism deficits. The result is better picture quality across the board. It's ready for the weather that you'll inevitably see first day of the hunt, and it's tripod ready, so you'll be able to mount this puppy to steady the 10x power. Only weighing 22 ounces, it's right within lightweight specs, and it has a 305 feet 1000 yards field of view, good enough. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. At Number 9. Bushnell Engage Binoculars. The Engage is one of the newest series released by Bushnell, and as a high-powered binocular, it has low light conditions and long-distance obstacles conquered. The eye relief is 15 mm, which is still a little on the short side for many, but there has been more than a gripe or two about it being shorter than that. You may want to rethink this spec if you wear glasses while glassing. This model has every optical feature you could look for just short of image stabilization. It has ed glass for reducing color fringing, phase correction coatings for improved contrast and resolution, and dielectric coatings for even more light transmission. The exo barrier coating is Bushnell's latest exterior coating that protects the objective lens from debris, water, oil you name it. For such a high-powered pair of binoculars with huge objective lens, it's quite lightweight at just under 30 ounces. It also has a decent field of view of 280 feet 1000 yards. Number 8 of my list. Athlon Optics Midas. It's another birding binocular, but we found its features more than adequate for hunting. In fact, you can always count on Midas to give you more than what you'd expect. The 8x42 model is popular with birders, no doubt. But, there are many hunters that can't quite keep a 10x magnification binocular steady enough for their needs and you have hunters that are often in tree stands in thick brush that find 8x more than adequate. You can check out the 10x42 model that is cheaper in price and has the same features, but it's not quite as popular as the 8x magnification, just fee. As the 8x magnification model, it has a much larger field of view. It has 85 feet more than the 10x magnification model maxing out at 426 feet 1000 yards. The fully coated lenses are HD quality because it has ed glass, dielectric coating, and phase correction coatings, it has the works. This means little to no chromatic aberration, sharp resolution, ultimate clarity, and picture-worthy image quality. You can get you'll get some decent low-light coverage with this little unit. Quality extends to the build with its magnesium chassis and argon gas, both are better than an aluminum chassis and nitrogen gas, just so you know. Dot dot, but, there has been some speak about the focus wheel. Coming at number 7. Swarovski. 46,211 CL. Swarovski introduces their binocular that comes in under $1,000, and it's no kid's toy. The CL pocket model may be small, but it's every much capable of keeping up with its full-size competitors. We know this is true because it's a Swarovski. The glass and overall quality is right in line with Swarovski's strict quality control manufacturing policies and is upheld with the same standards as their bigger siblings, regardless of its small size. Swarovski takes a spot as the best compact binoculars for hunting because it does come in at an affordable price point for a Swero product and is ideal for almost any application including hiking, birding and even close-range hunting with the outstanding image quality they provide. You also have their Swero Bright lens coatings, the Schmidt Pechen prism assembly, and of course, its extremely durable and weatherproof housing that can survive submersion up to 13 feet. At number 6, Vortex Optics Crossfire HD. Who said you can't get optics with HD for under 200 bucks? The Vortex Optics Crossfire HD proves those skeptics wrong. 
This Crossfire HD model has extra-large objective lens with their 50mm diameter. While you can expect exceptional low-light usage out of them, you're also tacking on extra poundage, raising the weight to 30. 4 ounces yep, it's a little bit heavy. But, with HD optics, you might find that extra weight worth it. What you get is better resolution and clarity both of which you'll need to be out at dusk and dawn. The wide field of view of 320 feet 1000 yards is excellent for a 10x50. Of course, since this is a Vortex, you're not only getting their exceptional VIP lifetime warranty in the buy, but your binocular comes fully weatherproof and shockproof all the types of protection you need for a Bino. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Halfway of my listed number 5. Celestron Outland X 10X42. The Outland X is your basic binocular, but it has all the fundamental features you need for the hunt. Keeping it low-priced and functional, Celestron fits the bill. The field of view is only 294 feet 1000 yards, which is just shy of 300 feet, so it's not quite as wide as some others out there. It does have a completely rubber armor body for body and shockproof protection and it's also waterproof and fogproof for weathering the elements and any accidental oopsie moments. Twist-up eye cups allow you to get a full picture of the field of view, but will only extend to 14 mm. It's lightweight for a binocular weighing in at 21.8 ounces, and it's compact in size at only 5.75 x 4.96 x 2.08. These specs become important when you consider that you will be carrying these around your neck. With 10x magnification, it's perfect for deer or elk hunting needs, but you can always mount it to a tripod stick if you need that extra steadiness that your hands can't achieve. Coming in at number 4 of my list, Nikon 8248 Aculon A211. It's a Poro Prism binocular with in-focus image quality and a fundamentally better optical system at its core. The offset lens design of this type of binocular isn't everybody's favorite, but it has its benefits in the field. Even though this 7x7.8 unit is Aprox. Too larger than its roof cousins, it's still quite compact for its type. It also has those large 50mm objective lens, and with high magnification of 10x, the field of view usually suffers, but not in this case since it has a wide 341 feet 1000 yards. With Eco Glass, it's made with arsenic and lead-free materials, and it also has a spherical lenses that provide a field-flattening view. This means that everything you are able to see at the same distance will remain in focus with clear and sharp detail from edge to edge of the field of view. However, Poro Prism binoculars are difficult to fully waterproof, and so you won't see that here in this entry-level model. Additionally, with a very tight eye relief of 11. 8mm, those who wear glasses are going to find these unforgiving to use. At number 3. Nikon 7577 Monarch 5. When the Monarch 5 was redesigned, it was predicted by the brand that it would be a favorite for hunters. With upgraded features, they proved themselves right. The included accessories have been a point of annoyance for some buyers. Between the ill-fitting eyepiece covers and caps and a Velcro case, the complaints are legitimate. But, Let's not judge a binocular by its hat and shoes. Instead, we'll judge this binocular by its DNA makeup. Unfortunately, it has quite the narrow field of view for a 10x42 with only 288 feet 1000 yards, but at least what you are able to see will quickly dissipate any feelings of dissatisfaction since it's repeatedly said to offer unparalleled focus and image quality. The binocular is a clear and sharp champ. It's the optics that sells this unit. It's all thanks to the ED glass, dielectric and phase coatings, and FMC optics. No color fringing, fuzzy sight picture, or focusing issues will be seen here. It has just over 18 mm of eye relief, so it has enough wiggle room for those who like to keep their shades on. It's right within weight spec demands of 21.6 ounces, and it's completely fog and waterproof. Coming at number 2. Vortex Optics Diamondback HD. The Vortex Optics Diamondback 10X42 is a long-time favorite series of optics from this awesome brand, but the newest line release is the best version yet. The Diamondback is 10 tenths for value. It has incredible features for the price, and of course, it comes with Vortex's VIP warranty that has won over many a buyer. 
As usual, the brand throws in some accessories, but this binocular comes with the glassback case and glassback case harness. Also included are some stock cap covers and a neck strap that some like and some don't. As for the binocular itself, it's an excellent optic. With multiple coatings, that includes FMC, dielectric, and armor tech coatings, you'll have clear, sharp, and bright images all day and night long. Low light and even dark coverage will be no obstacle for this pair. Color fidelity is kept intact and is appreciated since the additional HD optics and coatings significantly reduce chromatic aberration. And number 1. Vortex Optics Razor HD. Surprised to see a Vortex Optics binocular top the lineup when we've got world-known brands here too. That's because Vortex always does it well. The optical quality, design and aesthetics, and of course, price of this Vortex Optics Razer HD 12X50 has all been packaged together to present a binocular more practical and affordable for the everyday binocular user. Granted, a thousand bucks is not affordable, but compared to its competition, it's a steal it was a toss-up between the Vortex Optics Viper HD and this Razer, but in the end, we went with Vortex's most prized, high-end series. Its dimensions are more in line with what a hunter could use in a practical manner in the field for a full-size binocular. Vortex didn't leave anything behind on this razor. It's been preened and primped with a lightweight magnesium chassis, APO glass, and the true open hinge design. If there's a brand that caters to all the needs of a hunter and wildlife watcher, its Vortex good eye relief of 17mm will give you plenty of wiggle room to find that optical sweet spot, and if you wear glasses, it may be a little bit of a squeeze to get comfy with it. For more information and price, check out the product links in description underneath the video. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel, share this video and hit the like button.